This is Ryan from Technical Solutions here at Datadog. Today, I'm going to share the basics of setting up a graph using aggregation and rollups. The visualization we are using here is a time series, and the metric we are graphing is system CPU user. Our graph is currently showing us the average value of system CPU user across our entire environment. This is not very helpful for providing insight into my diverse cloud infrastructure. Let's look at a way that we can improve this. Uh, using tags, we have the ability to aggregate our data into groups. For example, if we wanted to understand our infrastructure by cloud provider or understand the CPU by cloud provider, we can add that tag in here. We now have a grouping for each value of the cloud provider tag. For example, Amazon Web Services, Google Cloud Platform, and Azure. All of these values are the average across each of those tags, but we have the ability to change that to a different method. For example, MaxBy. MaxBy is showing us the maximum value uh, for CPU across each of these cloud providers. We also have the ability to add functions to our graph. For example, the rollup function. This will roll up the metric by its maximum value in the specified time period. This is better demonstrated using the bar graph. Notice each of these bars represents a time interval of one minute. We have the power to change this time interval to whatever we may need. For example, five minutes or 300 seconds. Notice each of these bars is now representing the maximum CPU for each cloud provider over a five minute period. Aggregating into groups and aggregating over time with the rollup function is a great way to make your visualizations more actionable and specific. I hope this tips and tricks video was helpful. Thank you for watching.